An important update now on a story we broke here on KXOY 4 News yesterday. A North Idaho man who made national headlines for his fight against the EPA arrested on sex trafficking charges. Prosecutors say Michael Sackett and another man attempted to bring an underage girl across state lines in North Dakota to force her to engage in a commercial sex act. Sackett and his wife took their fight against the EPA all the way to the U.S. Supreme Court last year. Now he is facing another federal judge for these crimes. Annie Bishop now joins us live in the newsroom with an update. Annie. And Michael Sackett faced a judge in North Dakota this morning and had to turn over his passport, but he will not have to stay in jail. Sackett's fight against the EPA made him a hero of sorts for people who believe the government agency has too much power. That fight was about his property in Priest Lake, but sources tell KXLY4 he's been living in Williston, North Dakota, and working for quite some time. That's where he was arrested, and that's where he'll have to stay pending the outcome of this criminal investigation. Now, right now, the case is sealed because of an ongoing investigation, so we don't know the exact details of the allegations. A judge today ruled that Sackett could be released from jail without posting bond, but he has to stay in Williston and he can't have any unsupervised contact with any girls under the age of 18. Reporting live tonight, Annie Bishop, KXLY4.